Yeah, Master Chef. Uh, yeah, that's exactly what it feels <laughs> like. Huge, hundred flavors. I know. What are you getting? Wait, wait, wait. That one. This one? Dandela chocolate. Oh my god. Oh, that's the best one. Is it good? Like Ghirardelli one? No, this is Ghirardelli. Oh, what's the top? Water maple. Oh, I saw that one. Because your wife's Canadian? Yeah. I got my favorite Oreo mint chocolate chip. That maple one is phenomenal. It tastes like Canada. <laughs> These Baskin Robbins 100 started to kind of open up a little over a year ago, and there's like several locations now, but I looked it up and I couldn't find them in any other country. No, no, no I, not in states? I don't know. I couldn't find them. Let us know, you guys, if you have one of these in your country. I'm really curious. Because mm. I looked, but I couldn't find them. But as uh, you can see, they're pretty cool. We've got a really nice sunny spot, too. They must do such good business here because this area has a lot of companies. So I'd think like after the lunch hour, a bunch of company workers would come in here, grab an ice cream and just like bounce. I mean, downstairs Shake Shack, so. Yeah, there's a Shake Shack downstairs and upstairs there's this and there's a Dunkin' Donuts right over there. So it's like a food and dessert complex. We recently went to the Baskin Robbins 100 at Gangnam Station and we were blown away. They have a lot of special desserts, including the fondue sampler set. It was really cool to see that they actually had an organic section for flavors, which we've never seen before. Lots of cakes. And it was honestly kind of overwhelming looking at all those 100 flavors and deciding which one to get. But when we did, you order at this kiosk station here and the staff are really quick. They bring your order in no time. We sat down by a window. The place is really spacious and I got to eat my favorite mint chocolate Oreo ice cream. This is a Kuho experiment. I don't know if it's gonna be any good. Let's try it. Salmon, what is it called? I don't know. I just made it up. Huh? Mmm. I just uh, kind of combined recipes. Did you? Yeah. Mmm. What's in the mixture of this? Olive oil, thyme, parsley, basically like Italian seasoning. Mm -hmm. Black pepper, salt, paprika. Not bad, not bad. Hey, it's really nice. I miss having like a baked meal like this. Now that we have below oven. Yeah. 
can bake stuff. It's not for you. Look who we met. Monkey. Hi. Yeah, he's doing well. We think he's about like 14 years old at least, according to the neighbors. Apple Watch. Thank you. Who bought it? <laughs> Sorry, I needed some compliments though. <laughs> Nothing like a compliment to yourself. <laughs> oh, okay. Do you want to come up too then? I guess it's all three of us. There we go. Hi guys. <laughs> that took a while to get situated. Today is actually a holiday in Korea. Mm -hmm. It is March 1st. It's the March 1st independence movement. It was basically the largest independence movement by Koreans during Japanese rule. Mm -hmm. And um, tomorrow is actually the first day of the new school year. And your niece is starting school tomorrow. Already you have like a niece and nephew who are both in elementary school. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, guys, you remember last week, our video last week, we did mention that we were feeling kind of like mm -hmm. blah and kind of down and not really inspired. And it's still like persisting. I don't know what it is about this time of year. Yeah, it's like a whole month is just we're having PMS or something. Uh, yeah, that's exactly <laughs> what it feels like. Yeah, and I feel like nothing I or like we do work in creative wise is good enough. Mm. Even yesterday we had like a plan and we yeah. went out and we filmed it and it just mm -hmm. nothing worked out that day. So we got really frustrated and we just scrapped it. So today it is a holiday. I might do some a baking experiment today. Mm -hmm. I mean, I have to make hummus. It's <laughs> now it became like every yeah, week. Yeah, I thing. know. He's on yeah. hummus duty. Since we're kind of down, we're gonna grill some meat tonight. That's what. Yeah. Let's kind of treat ourselves and order a little bit of beef. We can have like a Korean beef barbecue. Yeah. So that's what we're gonna do this evening. Mm -hmm. my latest video for my book channel and it's a cozy little reading vlog of me finishing off the Crescent City series. I finished off House of Sky and Breath. If you are a reader and you like talking about books and you want to be part of the discussion, please pop on over to my book channel because I'll probably be uploading this maybe early to mid next week. That's what I'm aiming for anyway. Yeah, definitely have a lot of thoughts on that. So before Kiko and I go for our little afternoon walk, I want to thank Skillshare for sponsoring this video. I've actually been watching a lot of their classes lately on making short form content and reels specifically for my book channel. I've been having a lot of fun just making like silly reels for that. And there's this one class that I always go back to. It's the most comprehensive one that I've found. And it's called Short Form Video, Create Viral Videos for Instagram Reels and TikTok by Sean Dalton. This guy actually shows each and every step. And I mean, he breaks it down by like finding trending music, tips for editing your videos to make them like sync with the music better. We've been working with Skillshare for the last two plus years. They're an online learning community that have tens of thousands of classes on so many different topics, film and video, photography, cooking, there's a lot of classes also on entrepreneurship. So if you're looking for classes and inspiration on starting your own business or being a freelancer, there's so many options for that as well. If you're interested in trying out Skillshare, we do have a link in the description box and the first 1000 people to click that link will get a one month free trial of Skillshare Premium. Highly recommended. I've learned so many things from various classes on this platform. Anyway, we're going to go for a little walk before the sun starts to go down.
kind of made this last minute decision to add more lemon zest. I'm gonna make these into um, buttermilk biscuits instead, so I need some more lemon juice to make the buttermilk. I'm so hungry. I know, me too. I was getting really hungry when my biscuits finished baking, but I couldn't even try one because I was like dinner hungry. Man, it's been a while since we had this meal, so we didn't even have this sanjang, the sauce for this meat. We ran out of rice, so I had to go get it at the convenience store. Now we're all good, you know. No. Is it good? Yes, and it's so soft. Oh. Mm. This is Hachisai. We were just talking about, we ordered these groceries from Kukang mm -hmm. online, but you said that if we went to a restaurant and got this, it would be how much? 50, 60. Something like that, mm -hmm. I guess. Easily. Mm -hmm. And this was like, what, 26? 26. Mm. I by far prefer going at home. Not just because like it's way cheaper. You can pick the things you exactly want and it's not like so loud. Mm -hmm. The only downside is that smell. Yeah. Just open your windows later for a bit. Feels like it's Saturday because like the holiday, you know? Recently I read about um, soldier prices in the restaurants. I heard about that. Isn't it gonna hit like 6,000 won or something, but they're trying to keep it mm -hmm. to 5,000? Nowadays, soju's alcohol content also has decreased. Mm. So people will drink more and if it's more expensive, then yeah, I actually stopped drinking for uh, now. It's like 32 days. It's oh my god, this is officially mine. He's trying to get more fit and healthier. So I did dream about it once. Oh, yeah, drinking beer, it was so good. <laughs> That's all you need in your dreams. Yeah, why not uh, try this challenge? I'm trying to get ripped before the summer. Yeah. <laughs> hey, hey. <laughs> Get over there. You can't resist the beef smell, poor guy. It must be like, hey. <laughs> We're gonna feed you soon. You don't, you don't want this, it's not beef. Get, get. 